Hi traders, TJX is down 3.7%. I'm looking for a pullback. I'm always looking for stock to move up, then come down. Always need to see that. Here it goes, small pullback. I'm about to short it, 4,000 shares now. Okay, TJX, short, always look for a green candle and then short it. Because the green candle may move quite fast and you want to get in after it. Well, so much for TJX. It's getting close to the highs. I'm going to use a stop order here to stop it right at 74.11, which is a cent over the highs. I'm clicking the buy button right now. Again, use a stop order. Here's the stop price. Click the buy button. There's the order. Now, I don't usually use hard stops, but it is early in the day and I have a lot of trades to look for, so must use it right now. TJX, look at this. I hate to say it, nice breakout formation. It's going to take my stop. Oh, I'm out. Over $2,000. Not a good start. Well, at least I did have my stop there. SSYS is down 6%, which is better than what we, what we had with TJX. More likely to move down. I'm looking for a reversal. Again, I want to see it moving up, then down, which it did. Shorting now, 4,000 shares. Stop will be over the highs at 28.13. Well, I do hope for a better trade this time. I have to recover the $2,000 I lost earlier. I hate to say it, but... SSYS does not look so good. I'm going to use a stop order right here. Again, over the highs. It still is early in the trading day. I got to use a stop order, a hard stop. Also looking at uh, DKS here. DKS is down 11%. Look at SSYS. Oh my God, it's getting close to my stop. That's another $2,500 loser probably. I hope not. Hope it's gonna bounce here. No. Out of the game. Second trade. Two losers. Certainly is not a good start for me. Down five thousand five hundred dollars after two trades. Looking for a winner. Well here comes TJX again. Should I short it once more? I hope it's not just a revenge trade. I think I will. I'm about to short 4,000 shares. It's reversing now. Okay, shorting. Well, I do hope it's not a revenge trade. I usually walk away from the second move down because I'm a little bit concerned that I'm trying to take a revenge trade. Well, I hope this is not the case. It's all about timing. Sometimes you are very much right about a trade, but you got the wrong timing. I hope this one is the right one. TJX, glad I took this one. Up to grand. About to take my partial over here, 3,600 shares. At any pullback, watching the buyers and the sellers, I still see a lot of sellers. Look at the sellers. If they're going to come out, look at the sellers at 71. If they're going to disappear, I need there they go. I need to buy. Okay. You always look at the buyers and the sellers. You always look and see. If the sellers are moving up, if somebody is buying the seller's quantity, you don't want to stay there. And that's what happened with TJX. Well, I did reduce my loss in TJX, but I'm still down $3,450. Looking for some more trades. Just 40 minutes into the trading day. Lulu looks like a nice breakdown, but it's very, very volatile. If it does move down, okay, I'm going to short smaller size. Now, short at 2000 Lulu. I hope it's going to continue. That's a nice breakdown formation, but I'm not ready to have a big losing day. So again, smaller size.
I was waiting for DKS for quite a long time. It's down 10% and finally it looks like it's going to come down. It's not a huge move. Okay, now. Shorting 4,000 shares. It's down 10%. So usually when a stock is down 10%, institutional traders do not buy it. They just sit on the fence looking. Private traders, private investors, they do buy it, but the force is limited. So once a stock like that decides to move lower, it usually will continue. Well, that didn't quite work out in my early two trades, but I hope it's going to come right here with DKS. TKS, fine job, doing good, did break down, shorted at 59, it's down to 21 now, any pullback, here's the pullback, taking my partial, again, watch the buyers, watch the sellers, when you see the sellers moving up, don't watch the chart, watch the buyers, watch the sellers. So, DKS, $1,200, I'm doing a little bit better, I'm still down for the day, down two grand, started with five and a half, which is quite okay for, well, for recovery. Thank you for watching. Traders, I would love to hear your thoughts regarding this video, so let's have a discussion in the comments below. And if you are not subscribed to this channel, just go ahead and click subscribe. And if you like to learn trading, trade live with me and get a funded account without risking your money, click right over here in order to learn more about my funded accounts program.